Hey YouTube, this is a tutorial on how to get Lockhead on your Minecraft server. So go to Bucket and search Lockhead. It's this one right here. Just called Lockhead under anti griefing tools and admin tools. Click it. Click the download link. Save it to your desktop. Once it's downloaded, go to your desktop wherever you saved it, drag it into your plugins folder of your server. Should be an executable jar file, and if it's not, re-download it and save it as a jar file, which is .jar after the file name. Once it's there, click the run on your server, it'll start up, and it'll start up and make a folder for your plugin, and here it is right here, if you open it, there's a config file. If you go into the config file, all the stuff you could change for the plugin is in there. If you want to add more stuff to lock, for these are the stuff, these are the things you could uh, lock currently. Uh, door, chest, some stuff like that. You could add anything you want. If you want to lock a dirt block, you could put that in there. Just click enter after the last one. Put a dash, put a space bar, and then the ID of the lock. I'll put it in another link in the description for all the IDs a website that shows you all of them. And then when you're done with that, save it, go into your server, reload, type that in, and it'll reload the whole server, and it'll be updated on your server. And I'll show you in Minecraft how to use it. Okay, here we are again. Let's say use the server plugin. You put down a chest that you want to protect. It'll say right there you place a sign. Put it next to a chest. So just have a sign and right click the chest. Then click done and boom it says private in your name. And if you want to add more people to that chest, right click it again with your hand only. You can't have anything in your hand. Just right click the sign. Type in slash locket space bar the line of the sign that you want to edit there's four lines the first one is you can't edit the second is the name which is yours then if you want to add someone else you put a three for the third line then um then their name and then it'll pop up there and then they can open the chest too and if you want everyone to be able to open it i don't know why or just more names you put two signs on it if you want and do the same thing you could also edit furnaces do the same thing with furnaces put the sign on there it works fine and if you want, you could also do it with the door. It's, you type in private. And type in your name. See, so now it's just said I claim this door as mine. The only I could open it. And that's how you use a locket very easily. It's good for anti griefing, you could protect your house, your door, any of your items that you don't want people getting in there your furnaces, and pretty much anything else you want to protect in Minecraft. Thanks for watching. The new generation is mine, you know. I don't even care if they follow with me. As long as they lead it, that's why I love them.